So, and, and they used to include a lot of skincare, and they used to include a lot of, you, know, you get like a primer, three months running, you're like, can I have something people can actually see on my face? A lipstick? An eyeshadow? A mascara? Maybe? Something? But then my friend, Pink Poodle 2, showed off that she gets rocker box so I thought I'd sign up and apply for it and I signed up right at the end of September so I thought I'll probably just get October's box but I actually got September and October's box which means it's a double box unboxing because this arrived when I was looking like a hamster and then this arrived about 10 days later while I was still looking like a hamster and since then I've had collabs and stuff I've had to film so I've just not had time to do anything with these so I thought I would unbox them both together now so that you can see exactly what's in them and decide whether or not you're interested in it and I have to thank Jean because if, if she hadn't shown it on her channel, Pink Poodle 2, I would never have known about them. Best kept secret. So if you want to find out what's in these two boxes, you have the best seat in the house. As I've said for some considerable time, oft here echoed elsewhere in less imaginative places. But they don't have Sammy the Sloth straw back in the mark. Grab a drink. Grab a snack. Put your feet up. And enjoy. Because here it comes. Right. Uh, these boxes are £10 a month. Plus, I think it's three ninety five postage and packing, so it comes to about fourteen quid a month. Which, considering that the majority of the things you get inside here are full size, or at the least deluxe sized samples, is actually really good going. You get a little uh, leaflet telling you about all the products that are in here. This is the September one. And it said the September boss is all about you and the boss that you are. Everyone is bossing in some way and remember not everyone's success looks the same. I know full well how hard it can be to juggle work in between everything else you're going through. So whether you're working towards a promotion, or being a good friend or you're bossing being a mum, we want you to remember that you're a boss. We've also included some fabulous female owned brands this month out of respect to all those ladies doing their thang love Tia and that's the founder and CEO that's her there right the hero product of the month is this style London devil touch eyeshadow palette this is worth 15 quid so straight away this is worth more than the cost that I paid for the Palette. Now it's very very warm toned, um, to be honest probably not something I'm going to use but I'll be quite happy to pass that on to a friend because a lot of my friends are into these sort of warm tones, I've got a lot of warm tones anyway and you all know I'm more of a colourful person than a neutral and this is just a wee bit neutral for me. But, like I said, that's worth 15 quid, so straight away it's paid for the box, everything else is a bonus. Right, the next thing is this Duval's Lip and Cheek Colour. And I've got the shade Rose. This is worth 16 quid. Get my tweezers and I can get this packet open without losing a nail. Uh, this is perfect for quickly applying when you're out and about. It helps that it's lip and cheeks. So ideal for popping in your handbag. This Argan Oil 
can be used to tint and nourish your cheeks and lips, creating a luscious hydrating look without leaving you greasy. Hmm, that's interesting. So I shall give that a go on one of my no makeup makeup days. And that's worth 16 quid. So there's 31 quid already in this box. Then there is this uh, Like It On Top Juicy Lip Scrub. Does it say what flavour it is? Yeah, but really, really tiny. Uh, this is a female-owned brand. Oh, it's lemon. Look at that. That looks really nice. So, I sh that's a good sized pot as well. That'll keep you going for a little while. So I'm quite happy to have that. I did used to use the Jeffree Star lip scrubs and I have to admit I'm running very low on those. Then there's, uh, that was worth 11 .75. This is from, this is a Korean brand, OK. This is the Pomegranate Sculpting Tech Neck Mask. Hmm. If you spend hours hunched over a computer or are glued to your smartphone, you've been likely plagued with the pain and wrinkles known as tech neck. We've come to the rescue with this vitamin infused neck shaped fibre mask. Formulated with pomegranate, a rich source of vitamin X, it helps to fight ageing, plumps and restores skin and is the mask you never knew you needed. And if you look, it's shaped like that. So, adhesive hydrogel mask. Ooh! You leave it on for 20 to 30 minutes. I would do that tonight, but it's currently up, you know, getting on for 25 to 1 in the morning. Yeah, I'm filming this at that late. I can't sleep. I was in pain, so I thought I'd uh, do something useful with my time rather than just stare at the ceiling. Uh, then we got this from Brushworks. This is an HD eye brush. We all need tools we can rely on. Oh, that, that mask, by the way, was worth seven quid. We all need tools we can rely on. So this vegan friendly and cruelty free hand crafted brush is your new best friend. Its short bristles help to apply a controlled quantity of product onto the eyelid. The densely packed fibres are ideal for generating multiple eyeshadow looks of varying intensities, shapes and effects. Feels nice and soft. Oh, it's got it's got like a, it's it's like a triangular shape here with dimples to make it easy to hold, and it's a a flat pack of brush. This would actually be really good for your concealer as well. That's worth five ninety nine, and then we got a freebie. We got an extra treat, which is worth. This is a. How much is in here? This has got 100 mils in it. The full sized bottle of this is worth 18 quid. But that's like 50 centilitres. So that's what, five times the size of this? So this would be roughly six quid. No, three quid. Three quid. This is from Kaleino. It's a non alcoholic. Juniper and Inca berry drink. I wonder if it tastes like gin. Juniper is gin. Kaleno is a distilled tropical non alcoholic spirit inspired by the sun drenched spirit of Colombia. Zingy, zesty, and ready to party, Kaleno's Juniper and Inca berry is a tropical infusion of juniper, citrus, and spice botanicals. Pour Kaleno over ice and top with tonic and garnish with a fresh Inca berry. Available from Sainsbury's and Amazon. Mm. 
Hmm, that's interesting. So that is the September box, and that is well worth it. I mean, let's be honest. Love that. Love, love, love that. Right. Moving on to the October box. Again, £10 plus four quid. Well, three ninety-five. pounds as you're packing. Right. This month we are bringing you our AM PM themed edit. We have all the products you need for morning, day and night packed into a little pink box. Don't be rude. Stop it. We're stepping up your morning routines, protecting your skin from your daily smartphone use and helping you end the day with some great finishing touches. As always, I hope you love this as much as we do. The hero product this month is Mud Masky Blue Light Protection Mask. This looks to be a full sized product as well, so that's worth 44 quid. This is worth four rocker boxes without the postage. It's finally here, sunblock for your smartphone and laptop. It's the perfect replacement for your normal day cream when you're not in the sun. It prevents premature skin ageing caused by HEV light, which is found in all types of screens. Always try to keep 60 centimetres away from your blue light devices to help protect your skin. Hmm. Laptop, tablet, smartphone, television, LED light, computer screen. I shall definitely be giving that a go. Love me a bit of skincare. And this is what I mean. This, there's enough in here, this mask. Probably get maybe four or five uses out of this. Oh no, if you're using it instead of your normal day cream, if you're not using it as a thick mask, this probably would last me at least three weeks. Going on how much my normal eye cream lasts me. Not eye cream, a face cream. So that's that will give you long enough to work out whether this actually does you any good or not, which you're not going to get from a piddly little sample like most things get. You. So that is bloody awesome. Then we have in here somewhere. There we go. This is the Ico. I do liquid eyeliner and again this is full sized. Wow. Uh, this is worth 16 quid. Vegan, long lasting, fade proof and smudge proof eyeliner that lasts all day and night. I need to have a wiggle, I'm in a lot of pain, hang on folks. I'll probably cut this bit out. And I am back. Right. A uh, single stroke colour that doesn't skip or drag but glides on smoothly for that carbon black finish. Hmm. I'm not going to open this just yet because I've got two or three different eyeliners open at the moment. I don't want this to dry out. But I will be trying this, needless to say. Then we have a deluxe travel size. Grace and Stella Lavender Body Lotion. Ooh. Uh, infused with a light lavender scent to help relax your body and mind. Not only does it smell delightful, it's super nourishing and protects the skin for up to 12 hours. Uh, full size of this is worth £4, so that's awesome. Love me a bit of skincare. Especially when it's a sensible size skincare, you know. Then we have a deluxe travel size of this Hair Burst Growth and Volume Elixir. Award winning styling spray that does it all and only contains naturally derived active ingredients. Vegan and cruelty free formula enhances air vo hair volume and gloss, protects from pollution, UV and heat, detoxifies, improves hair density and reduces hair loss. As an added bonus, it is free from sulfates, paragons and silicons. And the full size of this is worth 9 quid. So I shall give that a go. 
good size, good size. Then we have at the bottom. Yeah. I've put the eyeliner back on top of it. This is Beauty Pro Pumpkin Infused Sheet Mask. 100% plant based mask contains organically farmed herbs that increase cell renewal, hydrate the skin and brighten your complexion. The sheet is biodegradable, made from natural bamboo fibres, meaning no irritation too. And the RRP for this is 4 95 15, 15 minute long treat yourself jobber. Ooh, then we have Kind Breakfast Bars. And there's two in here. Want a simple, these are extras that they've thrown in, these are bonus things that they've thrown in. So we've got a peanut butter one made with oats, millet, buckwheat, amaranth and quinoa, gluten free high fibre. And a honey roasted nuts and sea salt, Ooh, gluten free high fibre. Want a simple, delicious and nutritious breakfast? These kind snack bars are for you, being gluten free, high in fibre and 5 grains, it's bound to give you the kickstart you need, ideal for an on the go breakfast. Fab. I'm probably going to give these to Hubby because he works a very manual job and this would be great for him to have in his tea break. Not that he gets many of them. And then there's another bonus in here. Um, these, by the way, are worth one ninety nine each. And it's, this is the other bonus. This is Floor Some Drinks Sweet and Sour Apples. And it says, you saved two sweet and sour apples. Sp pressed wonky fruit and sparkling water. These drinks are made with imperfect fruits that don't quite make it to the supermarket shelves. So we're helping reduce waste by drinking these delicious drinks. This one's fizzy, fruity and 100% organic. Sparkling water and pressed fruit juice, basically. Uh, this is worth £1.50. I love this. But <laughs> Where it says wonky fruit, a friend of mine sent me the wonky donkey song. It's been stuck in my head for ages. I'd finally got it out and now reading wonky fruit, my head's doing wonky donkey in my head again. If you haven't heard the Wonky Donkey song, trust me, search for it on YouTube. Your kids will thank me later. So that was the, um, the two rocker boxes, September and October. Obviously I've flown through those quite quickly. But given that that's the first two boxes that I've had from them, I'm actually really impressed. Both of them had um, makeup items in. One had the uh, the cheek and lip tint and the lip scrub, and the other one had the eyeliner. And they've also got when they've got skincare in there. Not so much moisturising creams for your hand because they're like you know, ten a penny. That you you can tell if they're moisturising your hand or not. But in terms of moisturisers specifically targeted for the face for lines wrinkles etc etc to have a full size product worth 44 quid in the October box is bloody fantastic um, and like I said you know just one product from each of those covers the cost of the box so the rest of it's a bonus um, They've both been quite heavy on the skincare, but I can understand that because they don't ask you, when you sign up for the box, they don't ask you skin type or skin colour, um, or hair type for example, so it'd be difficult for them to include something like a foundation or a concealer or 
you know, a setting powder because even then, if you, you, know, you could say, oh, you could use translucent, yeah, but then translucent on some of my black friends leaves them looking ashy. They have to have a translucent deep or like a honey sh tinted one for theirs to be translucent. Um, so I can understand why there's only like the one or maybe the two bits of, of makeup in each one and they're more reliant on the skincare. I like the fact there's other things in there as well. Um, like that non-alcoholic drink which I'm looking forward to trying tomorrow with my lunch. Um, the one that maybe juniper because I want to see if it tastes like gin. Um, you know the, 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 the breakfast bars, the wonky fruit drink. I love the fact that that kind of thing is thrown in as an extra because it, it's for me what I've seen from those so far I would call them pamper me boxes rather than makeup subscription type boxes does that make sense I hope it does um, because there's you know there's a lot of things in there to make you pamper yourself there's face masks there's creams um, you know I'm actually really quite impressed with the two boxes that I've had so far um, I'll continue to get them for a while if you want to continue to see them on here I'll, I'll probably will open them on here if you find it boring if you don't want to see them if I get enough people telling me they don't want to see it I'll stop doing them Likewise, if I get enough of you saying, actually, yeah, we find this interesting, then I will continue to show them. Um, be interesting to see whether I get bored with them after a while, like I did with Birchbox. I think I managed about nine months of Birchbox before I got, ugh. And then I had a thing with Paper Gang, which was stationery, which I was really excited by, because I love me some stationery. But a lot of it was... It's kind of scrapbook time. There were lots of washi tapes and stickers and you know wooden die stamp things. It wasn't what I was picturing for stationery, you know. So I think I managed about six months of that before I got bored. So we'll see how long I think Rocker Box can keep my attention for. Right, if you're one of my normal 4F babies normal 4F babies. If you're one of my 4F babies, please double check you're still subscribed. YouTube are unsubscribing you and they're knocking the uh, notification bell back to personalised rather than all, not just for me but for all of the channels. I had to go and reset all of mine that I've got set. Uh, they'd all got knocked back to uh, personalised so it would absolutely be worth your while to double check that, not just for me, but for all the channels that you follow. Uh, they've been sneakily leaving me in people's feeds as well, even though they've unsubscribed me. So it's not always obvious that you've been unsubscribed because you're still getting my films suggested to you. Uh, once you've done that, let me know in the comments, what did you think of those boxes? Worth it? Not worth it? Are you interested in watching these? Are you looking forward to next month's one? Or are you like, mm, let me know. Love hearing from you. Uh, and as you know, I answer pretty much every comment that I get, unless it's rude. Then I'll either ignore you, or if I'm in a lot of pain, you might get a catty response back. Wow. Um, no, it's rare that I do that. Um, sorry, I'm struggling pain wise, I'm forgetting what I'm saying. Right, clearly it's time for me to take this off and head to bed. It's currently ooh, five to one in the morning, so I'm past my bedtime. I need to go get my beauty sleep. Clearly, I need to go get my beauty sleep. Um, if you're new here, however, hi, hello, welcome. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it with this slight madness of my channel uh, and the blethering that I do. I've got an awful lot of uh, other films that you could watch though. Um, it'd be lovely if you'd like to join the 4F family but I understand if you want to maybe watch a few films first because this is not normally what I have on my channel. Um, 
If you do want to subscribe, there's a little red button down there. You click that, you turn it grey. Then you ring my bell. Ring my bell. And choose all notifications and just hope that YouTube will send you some emails. They probably won't. Uh, the other films that I've got on here are all in playlists, so it's very easy for you to settle down and watch whatever it is that interests you the most. So I've got product reviews, tutorials, collabs, challenges, tags, I even reading my favourite poem. Mm. So basically, as I've said from what feels like time immemorial now, grab a drink, grab a snack, put your feet up, pick a playlist, get comfy and indulge. Right, my lovely ones, as ever, all that remains for me to say is your stay fabulous. And I will see you next time. Bye for now.